In this video, we will show you how to navigate and use CA Microscope for data collection. This video does not provide training on the clinical task. Please sign in with a Google account. We will not be using your name, email, or any personal identifiable information in our analyses or publications. However, we may use your email to contact you with follow-up information or questions. After login, you will be provided the participant consent form. Please read and accept the consent form. If you wish, you may download the consent form. Then click Continue. You will then come to this screen. If you have not already, please make sure that you complete the participant survey. This form is crucial. We need to know who you are and your qualifications. We may not be able to use your data if you do not complete the survey. You will then see a dashboard with different batches. Please do not complete batches in numeric order. Select one at random and begin evaluating. Once you select a batch, you will see a work list screen. Click open to select an image to begin annotating. Here is the default CA microscope data collection view. The main area contains a green box that is the region of interest for the current still evaluation. You can click and drag this image with your mouse to navigate around and the mouse scroll wheel can be used to zoom in and out. The bottom right corner holds the thumbnail of the entire whole slide image and a slider bar that shows and controls image magnification. Clicking on the thumbnail will move the field of view to that location. It is recommended to do till assessment at 20x on a screen that can show the entire region of interest. To return to the field of view with the current evaluation region of interest, click this target button. To return to the batch work list, click the home button. CA Microscope offers you many tools to help you as you annotate. First, selecting the bar graph button will show you a calibration cheat sheet. Please refer to it as needed while annotating. Second, selecting this question mark button will open a presentation on how to evaluate tills. You can review it or refer to it while annotating. The first step for your annotation is to select a label for the ROI. Then, in the second step, determine and record the percent of tumor-associated stroma that is within the ROI. In other words, how much of the region of interest is tumor-associated stroma where the denominator is the area of the ROI? You may use the mouse and slider bar or click on the number and edit with your keyboard. Then, assess the density of stromal tills within the ROI. You are free to pan and zoom to other areas of the slide to see the tissue context and to help you annotate, but please only evaluate the ROI marked by the green box. You may also want to refer to the calibration cheat sheet and other training materials to help you as you annotate. Once you are finished, please click Save and Next to move on to another ROI. Once you have completed the entire slide, select the Home button. After you evaluate all the ROIs for an image, you will be taken to the batch work list. Please continue with the rest of the slides within the batch we may not be able to include partial batch results. Once you have completed all the slides in a batch, you are welcome to return to the collection list and start another batch. Please complete as many batches as you would like. We would prefer if you completed all eight. Thank you for your attention and time.